Hey family, how's it going? This is Marissa, and welcome to my first Daiso haul. Now, what Daiso is is um, Daiso is a store that started in Japan, and they brought it over here into the United States. Um, they're expanding it a lot in my cities, my city, and neighboring cities. Um, it's equivalent to the Dollar Tree store here, except 98 point I would say 9% of the things at Daiso is is a dollar fifty instead of dollar instead of a dollar like Dollar Tree. Um, the rest of the items are like two fifty or four dollars. Okay, so I'm gonna get right into the haul and I'm gonna kind of talk to you about the store and how it looked while I'm doing the haul. The first thing I got there is this cute, um, really cute uh, glass case. They have a lot of, you know, regular modern stuff, but they come in these really cute packages that make you go, ooh, oh, maybe I should get it type of thing. I also got this uh, mirror that's really cute. Um, it's a compact, so it can be uh, stored in your purse, um, and so when you need a mirror. Um, and I like it because it has this stand. And I've seen mirrors like this throughout the years. Um, another thing I got was this lint remover, um, and it's packaged like this. And here's one of the cute little packages I was telling you about. That's the thing about, um, Diaso that will get you. They have the real, real cute, uh, packaging. And you know what it reminds me of? The store. When you get in there, um, the first, the sign is, I believe, pink and white. And then inside of the store, it's, the floors is white, the walls are white, and they have all these little colorful things. It reminds me of Hello Kitty. You know, um... I noticed a lot of aging uh, products and uh, things are very um, eye-pleasing to the uh, consumer. So they may not even be the greatest or the best product, but it, it, they have so many beautiful colors. And the way they package things, it'll make you want to buy it. Another thing I got was these he he um, retractable headphone set. And of course, I've seen things like this in Dollar Tree. Um, and, um, I think I've gotten some like that. No, I've gotten headphones, but not those from, uh, Dollar Tree before. Um, another thing I got is this Embozer. Um, and I think this is really cute for, like, little crafts and stuff. I bought these uh, Dream Animals uh, coconut flavored biscuits and I love Agent products, food products because their cookies and their candy and their chips are never too sweet or never too salty. They're just the right amount. Um, and the serving size is, sometimes it's small but it's the right serving size. So I've always liked it and I do like these cookies. They're not too sweet at all. I also saw something that surprised me. I saw a clean, clean clean color there and um, I got this foundation product um, it has some beautiful colors in there um, multi shade blush and bronzer so you have like a pink a, a dark brown um, the one that light brown that looks like the bronzer and then you also have an orange color very pretty and then I got these nails. They're dollar fifty, and I thought they were really cute because I got some really cute charms from there. And I think it would be nice to like polish them, put the charms on, and then put them on my uh, fingers. And then I also got these nails that I am loving as well because you could polish your um, the fingers, the nails on here using this uh, stick. And then um, go ahead and put like, you know, the little um, bling bling and bedazzles on it and then take it off and put it on your finger. And I thought that would be like a good project to do. And these are the um, nail jewels that I got and I thought those were real pretty. These are the red ones. This one is a peach. And I went twice to Diaso. I went today, which is the what? The 15th, I believe? Yeah, it's Friday the 15th. And I also went last week, 
Sunday, I want to say. And then, um, also I got this Melon Liquid Hand Wash, and it's in lavender, and this was a dollar. And you do see very few things that are marked down, you know, to a dollar. But I think a dollar is the minimum. This smells so good. When I was in the store, I didn't even smell, smell it because I like the size of it. And I said, oh, I need some hand soap, so let me go ahead and try it. And I'll let you guys know how that works out. Okay, moving right along. Another thing I got today, and I think is so cute, is this beautiful notebook that says, The Beautiful Flowers for My Love, and it has a heart on it. And let me open the pages. Isn't that pretty? Just a regular little notebook, but I thought it was so cute. And again, a lot of these stuff um, you can get in Dollar Tree. You just won't get it in these cute little packages. Now, the notebooks, I've seen some cute notebooks there. Um, the things that I really liked were some of the kitchen utensils. Um, they would have you buying things like a banana peeler. Now, what I need a banana peeler for? And a banana is easy just to peel off and eat. But I thought of getting it because it was cute. It was uh, one that was in purple. Um, it had a purple handle to it. It was really, really pretty. They had an apple peeler. They had nice forks. You know, anything that somebody would need for, like, their dorm room or a new apartment or something. They had little trash bags. They had um, a lot of craft stuff. Okay, this is another thing that I got, and this is uh, Soap to Fragrance Ear Freshener, and this is in lavender, and this was also $1.50, and I really like it because, of course, the purple color, the fact that it's lavender, because that is one of my favorite scents, and the fact that it's really a nice size um, jar. I'm trying to look for the size to see. It doesn't say, but this is really a nice sauce. I can't wait to try it, and I'll let you guys know. I also got this little piggy bag from there that I thought was really cute. I have a project that I am working on, and I'm going to fill this all up to quarters. Only quarters are going to be in this, and I'll talk more about that later on in another video. Moving right along. I also got this right here. Now, doesn't it look like a little umbrella? It isn't. What it is, it's um, a shopping bag. And I haven't opened it. I'm going to open it with you guys. And it just has its own little personal bag to it. Let me see. It's really pretty. I love the color. Voila. That, this is a really nice size little bag. That's cute. Oh, it is really cute. It reminds me of a little shirt. But it's a bag, y'all. That is so cute. And it comes in this little personal bag. I will be putting it back up in there and wait till I am ready to use that. Also, I got some cough drops from there, and this is lemon-flavored cough drops. I just wanted to try something different, and I did try them, and I do like them. Um, it tastes more like candy than anything, but it tastes like, you know, those halls, the little grapefruit ones and uh, the orange ones. It tastes like that. It's not too strong. It, it's nice. It's bearable that you could eat it and you'd like to keep on eating it. It's not too um, menthol. It doesn't have that menthol taste. Um, another thing that I got, which I didn't like, is these uh, green peas uh, chips. Now, I have tried these green peas chips in Trader Joe's. They have... Um, uh, a variety they have a product like this but I didn't like how these looked or how they taste the one at Trader Joe's they're more whole and they're uh, straight and I don't know something about this and I'm not going to eat that because I, I don't want to you know gain weight or I don't want to get fat off of something I'm really not enjoying this now I did enjoy and this is their muscat gummy uh, candy and this is their grape flavor, and it comes in little individual uh, packs like this, which I love. I love the fact that the gummies are not um, just in the one bag. I like the fact that it's in this a little um, pouch right here. And let me show you how it looks. 
it's shaped like a heart and they taste so good and again the thing I like about aging products is it's not that sweet it just has enough sweet that you know could wet your palate but it's not that sweet okay excuse me for eating on camera I hate when people do that but my um, throat is a little dry the next thing I got, which are so good, now these taste more like coffee, I mean more like candy, is this peach uh, coffee drop. And then again the packaging, isn't it inviting? These are so good. These taste actually better than the lemon ones to me. And lemon is usually my flavor. Let me see. Is that it? That is it, y'all. Okay, so the first time I went Sunday, I put myself on a budget and I said, okay, Marissa, since things are a little bit more than Dollar Tree, you don't want to go in and buy a whole lot of stuff. So your budget will be $20. When I got up to the um, cashier, um, my, all my things came out to be $20 and some change. That was the first time I went and also the second time I went. And I wasn't really counting the things. I was just kind of eyeballing them and making sure I didn't get too many things. Now, I got, each time I got 13, a $20, I paid $20 and something cents for 13 items. Now, you know, at Dollar Tree, that would be just $13 for 13 items. And, of course, um, a little bit of tax, but still, it wouldn't be that much. So a lot of these things that I saw there were really cute and crafty. And like I said, were things that you were like, hmm, this is cute. Let me try this. They had a lot of um, beauty stuff. They had a lot of things like eyelashes, eye, um, eyebrow cutters, um, eyeliner stuff. Same things that you um, see in Dollar Tree. It's just the, the products are different and the packaging at Diaso, I would say, is a little bit better. Will I go back? Yes. But I will make sure that I still keep myself on a budget because this is a store that you could go in and go crazy on. And before you know it, you're spending like $40, $60, $80, up to $100 of things that you can go to Dollar Tree and get. But I had a really great time at this store. And I will do some reviews on some of these things. If you see anything that you'd like me to do a review on, please let me know. Thank you guys for watching. I love you. And as always, smooches.